your knife glide through foods more easily and the foods don't stick to the blade as much. It's actually a combination of three knives. You see a chef's knife, a santoku knife, and a utility knife. You put those together and you're getting that shape of the knife. Now what you see when you look at the blade from the top down is a waviness to the blade. On the bottom, however, it is a straight edge, but having those waves means that there's less metal that comes in contact with the food. Therefore, it actually slides through so much more easily. And David, cheese, I'm gonna show you cheese in a little minute, how you can slice through that. But cheese, potatoes, things that stick, they don't stick to this knife. And, and that makes you, you more efficient. Well, exactly. And as you look at this uh, animation, you can see that less of the knife is actually coming in contact with the food. And when I say less of the knife, I mean less of the sides of the knife. Exactly. Because exactly. obviously the knife, the, uh, the edge has to come in complete contact with the food to cut it. But the sides of the knife, less knife comes in contact with the food. Therefore, it's less likely that the food is going to right, stick. Right, because this is the problem. Now, I'm using a very good knife here. It's a knife that, that I like. But look at that. It sticks all the time. So then you're always pushing that off and, and trying to keep going it slows you down in the kitchen well when you use the groove utility it just doesn't stick because there's less of the knife to stick to because of that wavy design so you get to be more efficient and here is what really makes a difference when you're cutting into something that's rather large like this big piece of cheese you can use a regular knife like this and push but because so much of the knife blade comes in contact it worries me every time you do this. i know i know because you think you're going to cut yourself or you're going to slip and cut yourself gonna, exactly but with Look the utility it just slides right through because there's less of the knife to get stuck on on the cheese because of that wavy design. So it makes life so much easier. Even things like this, when you're doing a, a maybe making stuffing and you need to cut into uh, bread, look how nicely it slides through there. Or the kids say, mommy, please cut the crust off my sandwich. Right, and you say, no, eat those crusts. But look at that, <laughs> look at that. This is soft bread, but because the, util the utility knife is so sharp, made of Japanese stainless steel, it actually doesn't crush the bread. Do you know that this knife, in the short amount of time that it's been offered at QVC, is already customer top rated? Not and surprised. every single one of the ratings, Meredith, is five stars. Wow. Every single person that has reviewed this knife on QVC.com has given it five stars. Now, I will tell you, this is the younger brother of another Groove Tech knife that we've had on the air mm -hmm. here at QVC. And it's still available, I understand, on QVC.com. Is right, that correct? Right, the Meza knife, right. The Meza knife. Now, I would encourage you to pick this one up as a great compliment to that knife because it is a bit smaller. Look at this. Meredith, that's no baloney. <laughs> well, it is, actually, but you look at that. Well, it is baloney, but it's no baloney right if you catch my meaning. Right through this without any trouble at all. So even, even though the knife is not super huge, it does the job it needs. It's a utility knife, groove utility knife. It makes things easier, even things like a harder salami. Ooh, we should make a fried bologna sandwich. We should. You ever had fried bologna? I have, actually, just once, but yes. Oh, I'm guessing you didn't love it if you only had it once. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not something I have around the house often, but hey, it was well, good. Well, a fried bologna sandwich with some nice mustard and cheese, that'd be good, wouldn't it? Mary, you like fried bologna? Mm -hmm. Of course I do. Doesn't everybody? <laughs> okay, so it was not raised on vegetables. <laughs> Mary's like, she was not raised on just vegetables. <laughs> Look at this. This is amazing. Oh, and I should, uh, and I, forgive me, I have failed to mention, I've been so mesmerized while you're slicing, um, that we have two colors to offer you. We have the red and we have the black. So uh, 600 of these are already gone. I have the red and I have the black. Now, red is more limited of the two colors. This is $23.86. Now, here's the animation again that really helps you understand why this knife Right. is so impressive. So we took the shapes of the three most popular knives, a utility knife, a chef's knife, and a santoku knife, but we put them together with this very special patented blade that has waves on it. And yet it has a straight edge, David. It'll always cut a straight cut. But because of those waves, less of the metal of the knife comes in contact with the food. As a result, it's easier to get that knife through things that are sticky, like cheese or potatoes. Things like that don't stick to the blade because there's less knife to stick to, but most importantly, it's easier to slice through things. It makes a world of difference, and when you can slice efficiently like this, you're just more efficient overall in the kitchen. You're not stopping to wipe things off of your blade. Sticky. Mozzarella yeah. is really tough to slice. But look, look at that. You slice down, and it falls away from the blade because there's just less of the blade to stick to. I mean, there's no trick here, which is, look at that. It just falls right away. So things like this made much more easy to do by, uh, by the Groovetility. And yes, you can cut all kinds of things. So even when you have some chicken breasts that you've finished uh, sauteing, you can go ahead and cut these as well. Because it's Japanese stainless steel, it has a sharp edge, holds its edge for a good long time, and then when you need to sharpen it, 
You just sharpen it the same way you would sharpen any other knife. It has a straight edge, if you see there at the end. A straight edge to that blade means you're gonna get straight cuts, and it also means you can sharpen this with any normal sharpener that you have. It's beautiful, and don't think you're going to have ridges in what no, you cut. No, no ridges, of, no waffle cut. Yeah, it's, it's, not, it's designed to give you a straight slice, but the, uh, the, uh, the groove design on the side actually lets less of the knife come in contact with the food, so therefore you have much less sticking. Exactly, and to, for all your little vegetables that you need to do, you can do with this uh, utility knife. It doesn't have to be something that's sticky like cheese and potatoes. It can do those as well. Let me tell you that 2,000 knives are now gone. What we brought in in the red for our show today is already half gone. So if you want the red, please don't wait. That is much more limited than the black. We brought in a little bit more of the black. But what we have left, uh, actually in the red, what we brought in for the day, we have exactly half of it left. So please grab this now while you can. $23.86. Meredith and I presented this the other evening in our midnight show after our Rachel Ray Today That's special right. value. It was very popular on that night as well. So yes. lots of people making the switch to this groovetility technology. Well, you know what? Because it's not something that everybody has already. Nobody has, like, you know, if you have a cook in your life you want to get uh, a gift for, this is a great gift because they don't have it already because it's the combination of three different knives but with some patented technology that's on the blade. And those are in the form of these waves. And what those waves do for you is they just create some room between the food and the knife so that there's not as much knife to actually get stuck in the food and not as much knife for the food to stick to. So when you're cutting things like cheese, potatoes, apples, things don't stick to the blade. Which I is love it. so important. Well, it's now, efficiency, right? $23.86. Not only is this customer top rated, every single rating is a straight five star. So don't miss out on this. We'll get you all squared away with something very special. And over 2,500 of these are now gone. And I have 800 people who just jumped on the phone lines. Now, just when you thought you needed 17 different knives in the kitchen, suddenly this goes from being <laughs> your chef knife and your chopping knife to your bread knife. Well, exactly. And David, look at this slice. You see the slice of bread. It's not wavy. You're getting a perfectly straight slice of bread there, even though you have the waves on the blade. All those waves do is actually create a little room between the food and the blade. So it's very easy to glide through. Just makes it so nice to actually do all that chopping of anything that you need to do, especially what you're going to notice the most is when you do cheese, like a big old block of cheese. 3,000 are now gone. And if you want the red, I started with 3,000 red. I have 1,000 left in the red. A few more to go around in the black, but this is going very, very quickly. Customer top rated, $23.86. Now, take a look here. Now, I hesitate to give you the other knife. You want me to try? But I just want you to show again, and let's make sure this is completely seated so you see, on the board. See, when you use a knife like this, which is a good knife, don't get me wrong, it's a good knife, full tang knife, but when you put it on the cheese, you always have to grab a towel to protect yourself from that tip because trying to get this knife through the cheese is very, very hard because there's so much of the metal that comes So much in resistance, contact. yeah. Exactly. When you use the groove tility knife, look. It goes right through. It's like, it's, how are you doing? It's, <laughs> it's so nice. Slice the cheese. It's such a nice relief to do that. And yet it can still, of course, do all those vegetables that we, uh, we you know, sometimes struggle with. Believe it or not, tomatoes, a member of the nightshade family, have very tough skins. And they can actually be hard to slice. But look at that. And all the slices stay on the counter where they should, not on your knife. This is beautiful. We are very, very busy on our phone lines. In fact, 4,000 knives are now gone. Everyone is grabbing this one. And if you want the black one, I have 2,000 left. If you want the red, I have 500 left in the red. This is $23.86. It's customer top rated. It's K41612. And we are very, very busy on our phone lines. Please don't miss out on this opportunity. And everyone's taking advantage of the red and the black. But that red now is very, very limited. Please don't miss out on that. Meredith, thank you, my darling. Thank you. Always a pleasure. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you. All right, I'm going to go over here and join our Mary. Um, Zach told me to give you this note. And, oh, well, thank you, Zach. Zach's one of our crew. Uh -huh. It says great job. Well, thank you, Zach. Yeah. You're a good man, Charlie Brown. <laughs> All right, so we have had a big, big show today. Yes, we did. Lots of fun, lots of excitement. Thanks again for all your help today. Oh, always. We are moving me around to multiple sets, and when that happens, we need to be able to check in with Mary, and she did a great, great job as always Thank today. You, my hey, want to welcome the over 1,200 brand new customers Woo! who shopped with QVC today for the very first time during In the Kitchen with David, so that was really fantastic. Welcome. Want to let you know that Wednesday night, 
I have to be away. Yes. And so Jill Bauer will be hosting.